God bless everyone, this is Brother Josh, and I wanted to share another dream God gave me. But this one was about heaven, which I think will encourage you if you're going through a difficult trial or if you're just feeling discouraged. In this dream, I saw that I was working in heaven. In heaven, I saw that there are many different activities. God is going to give us tasks that we must do, different assignments. Heaven is a city, a celestial one, but still a city. And every city has a wide variety of activities going on. But the activities in heaven are all going to be exciting. They're going to be things we're going to love doing. And I remember that I was enjoying my job. And the job that I had was writing down reports for God. I was writing down reports on one of those old-fashioned scrolls with a white paper. And I remember that I was walking inside of a school, writing reports of what was going on. And everything that I saw was breathtaking and beautiful. Heaven is such a visual treat. The colors, the textures of the walls, the floors, the materials used for the buildings. Everything is beautiful, just stunning. But like I was saying, my job was to write down reports about the school's activities. God gave me that job because he knows how much I love writing. And it's one of the talents he gave me. He wanted me to use that talent on earth and in heaven. And upon hearing one classroom, I opened the door and was invited inside by the teacher. Then I began to listen to the class. First thing I noticed, everyone was very polite and very attentive. And the teacher was asking questions about the Bible. Surprisingly, some of the students didn't know the answers being asked, which made me think, how could they not know? These questions are so easy. But then God showed me that these were Christians who had died shortly after accepting Jesus, before they had the opportunity to read the Bible and obtain its knowledge. Also, some of those students were babies and children whose lives had been cut short on earth. These youngsters also did not get the chance to read the Bible. But it was such a beautiful dream that I will never forget. In another dream, I found myself in my house in heaven. There, some men came to visit me, and I noticed that these men were also working. One of the men was in charge of getting things for the other houses in heaven, furniture, decorations, things like that. While the other men had jobs that I can't really describe because those jobs don't exist here on earth. In another dream, I was walking through a lush tropical forest which had the most beautiful trees and plants. The colors there were not like the ones here on earth. The colors in heaven had more saturation and light, but in a way that made everything look enchanting. You could stare at the flowers for a long time and never get bored. Each plant radiated beauty that left you feeling happy. In another dream, I was sitting down in a table with two of my childhood friends. The three of us were just hanging out, in heaven, eating the most delicious food ever and talking and laughing. I remember we were having the best time of our lives. Everyone was full of joy. Our faces looked rejuvenated, young, fresh, no wrinkles, no blemishes, because we were in our perfect, glorified bodies. In another dream, I was standing in front of the Father's throne. It was huge. God looked like a giant. But I could not see the Father because there was a white cloud blocking him. All I could see were his feet, which again looked gigantic. I remember gazing in awe at the cloud, how beautiful it was full of glittery light, sparkles, and swirls of energy. Even the clouds in heaven will take your breath away. Every single thing in heaven is stunning to behold and brings a smile to your face. God is the ultimate designer. He designed heaven in a way that people's jaws are going to drop when they walk in through the pearly gates. God has so many wonderful activities planned for us. It's going to be amazing. To be honest, when I was young, I actually used to be afraid of heaven, of the thought of eternity, because I would think, what if I get bored? I mean, it's eternity. But now I realize that is never going to happen. We will never be bored in heaven. Number one, because time does not exist in heaven. Everyone is always in the present there. It's never the past or the future. It's always the present, the now. We're always going to be in a present state of amazement and joy and peace and wonder. Life is going to be so much better in that celestial city. No more bills or stress or sicknesses. Everything is going to be perfect for all eternity. And so I hope that hearing this dream lifts your spirit and gives you more motivation to keep on seeking God despite whatever trials you may be going through. Because in the end, it's going to be worth it. Trust me. Also, I want to invite you to a fasting chain I'm organizing. It starts September 15th, 2023 and ends December 31st, 2023. 
I will be fasting daily to ensure the fasting chain does not break, but you can fast one or two days each week or one or two days each month. More people means more power unleashed to us, so please join us. Here are the two petitions for the fasting chain. Number one, for God to save, deliver, heal, bless, protect, and guide everyone in this chain, and for God to never erase our names from the book of life so we can spend eternity in heaven with our Savior Jesus Christ. The second petition is for God to answer all the petitions people present me in comments and emails. Please make sure to write your petitions in the comments of my videos or email them to me. And if you're interested in learning more about spiritual warfare, deliverance, and how to interpret your dreams, please check out my book, The Last Web Fasting One Year. Links are below. And that's all I have for today. I'll be sharing more revelations, testimonies, and teachings on this channel soon. So please like this video, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you can be notified when new videos are released. God bless you, and I'll see you soon.